G'day everyone, my name is Dedicated Duck, and today I'm just going to do a quick tutorial on how to get your PS4 controller to work on your PC. Now, if you've already got Windows 10, like I do, then, and you only play on Steam, then it should work. I use the PS4 controller with Rocket League all the time. But the problem I had is when I got the uh, new Need for Speed game, Need for Speed Payback on Origin, I'd never actually tried to use a PS4 controller on it before, and I found that it didn't work, and I had to actually use the arrow keys to do the uh, first missions. And after a little bit of research, I found that the problem is easily solved by going onto Google, typing in DS4, and downloading the DS4 Windows mod. Now, what it does is it basically emulates your PS4 controller as an Xbox controller or Microsoft controller. So you'll go onto the site and you'll click download now and you'll download obviously the latest version. There. Now I'll put it into my downloads. Ah, uh, yes, I've already downloaded it, it was already there, so download it again. Doesn't take much. Open it up. And it is in a zip folder, so you will want to create a new folder on your desktop. I'll just put it under DS4. Drag it into there, and you'll go DS4 Windows. And it should come up with a little window, so it shows it's connected. Because I use a cord, you'll have to use a cord to plug it in. Like some people um, use Bluetooth adapters, but I always use a cord, it makes it a lot easier. And if I unplug it, it disappears. Plug it back in, it works. And it'll emulate it as a um, Xbox controller, so when you go in game, it'll come up with all the Xbox control buttons like right bumper, left bumper, um, Y, B, X, and oh, I cannot remember the other one. Okay. But yeah, it'll emulate um, the Xbox controller and Microsoft controller, but, and it won't take long to pick it up if you already know sort of your basic controls of like, oh yeah right trigger to accelerate, left trigger to break or if you're using other games to aim and shoot it's basically, basically the same but just with different symbols so yeah if you had this problem and this uh, video helped you out make sure to give it a thumbs up if you have any questions or it didn't work make sure to put that down in the comment section below so and I'll try and help you out um, as best as possible and uh, make sure to check out all my other content and subscribe if you want to keep keep up with all my future content and as always I'll catch you in the next video see ya